Good morning, everyone. It's Tuesday, January 26th, 2021. I have to tell you, yesterday I had the opportunity to listen to one of my former students when I taught third grade. He was in my class and now he is a senior in high school and he has become a nationally ranked, that means he's really good at BMX trick bike racing. He even showed some videos about it. And it was so interesting hearing him talk about how that talent that he has has helped him be focused and be stronger and actually do better in school because he learns that in order to do something and do it well, you have to practice and practice and practice. His message was to work hard and to keep trying and that you're going to fail from time to time but it's all part of learning. And I thought, what an awesome message. And I was super proud of him. So if you happen to know Christian Earhart, tell him that I heard him and I sent that message to our virtual school kids. We have our joke of the day. How did the barber win the race? So make sure you think about that. Don't forget about our virtual school talent show, flipgrid.com. Go to quick4675. All right, so my poems of the day today are called The Sword Swallower. That's the first one. And the second one is called Arrows. Here's The Sword Swallower. I do not want to be a sword swallower. That I never want that to be my talent. I think that would be a very dangerous talent. But here we go. The great sword swallower, Solomon, he wears no ties or collars. He leans back, opens up his mouth, and gulp! His sword, he swallows. I guess he finds it fun to feel that steel down in his belly. It's fine for he, but as for me, I'll take some bread and jelly. For sure. I'll tell you that. Okay, our next one is called Arrows. I shot an arrow toward the sky. It hit a white cloud floating by. The cloud fell dying to the shore. I don't shoot arrows anymore. All right, everyone, stay warm out there today. Supposed to get a little bit of snow. Not so great weather. We are in winter for sure right now. Got the cold, got the wind, got the nasty, icy, snowy weather. It's okay. We're going to get through it. Um, please take a look at our two great shout outs, and I will see everybody back here on Wednesday. Don't forget, Wednesday is a learning day. Just because you may not see your teacher face to face, it does not mean that you ignore the assignments that your teachers post for you. They need to be done that day. You need to engage in learning in order to move forward. I'll see everybody back here tomorrow morning.